driving to the goal. That's what Kemba Walker does right here. Blocked by Crowder. Butler leading the break. Duncan Robinson gets inside, flips it off off in from three. Number one in the playoffs, 88% during the regular season. The rare two-pointer, but an effective one is the Celtics turn it over. Jeff, turnovers you talked about at the top. And that's been the critical part of why the Celtics are down 3-1 as we have ever seen. Well, prior to that, in the first four games, he's taken 32 shots here in the series. 31 of them were from three. Uh, but I also want them to step in with aggressiveness and confidence with open looks. Adebayo misses the baseline jumper and Tatum the rebound. Tatum had a sensational game seven against Toronto. Did a little bit of everything to keep their season alive then. This versus what Miami has done. Tatum hitting the free throws. The Heat, by the way, all season long, only once did they have a three-game losing streak. That was back in February. It was on a West Coast trip. Robinson way outside. A little strong. Rebound goes to Tice. But it's the ball pressure. In the last ball game, that had been a, a three-point at the line as opposed to five feet away. Good pressure by the Celtics. Absolutely, and they've had a couple deflections on. Walker shoots over Dragic and comes up short. Boston one for seven to start, including one for five from three-point range. Butler trying to draw some contact. Bam out of bio gets inside and lays it up and in. Tightest game of his career. It's a huge game for him, and they need him to be aggressive. They need him to be have the mentality of a scorer, especially against this Miami Heat zone. Yeah, but you don't get to the conference final if you don't win the other game. Granted, is out of bio misses, gets his own rebound, stripped. Gordon Haywood, a very early entrance into the game. And a very early going to their five small guys with no center lineup. Both teams struggling to get it going shooting-wise here in the opening minutes. Butler kicks it back out. Dragic up top to Crowder. Nice give and go. Crowder, oh, blocked by Tatum, but a go. Walker again. Aggressive goes at Dragic. Now it's Haywood gets into the paint. Stolen by Robinson. Crowder back to Duncan Robinson. Goes up and lays it up and into the paint. <laughs> it certainly is. He's a two-point machine. It's in your state. Check out vote.org for everything you need to vote. Celtics in an early six-point hole. Jalen Brown attacks the basket. Layup won't go. Tip missed. And Jimmy Butler comes away. Boston looks discombobulated offensively right now. Just one for 11 from the field. Marcus Smart on Adebayo. And we say Adebayo with Smart on him. Little fake. Gathers, goes up, and call for travel. Lifted that pivot foot. Pass there from, look like they're playing tight right now. Butler picked up by Smart. Crowd has got Walker on him. Shoots over him, and a foul call on Kemba Walker. It's going to be three free throws. At the end of the day, he made plays, made shots, and act like he belonged on, on the big stage. He was spectacular. Uh, and it's no disrespect, but that can't happen again. Tatum, aggressive to the basket. Well defended. I think they got a piece of it. Here comes Butler the other way. Boy, Miami looks sharp early. Andre Iguodala has come into the game for them. Butler spins. Foul line jumper, got it. 15 for them. As opposed to the Celtics right now, they're trying to look sharp offensively and start up instead of generating some. Haywood now switches up on Butler. Butler takes it into the paint. Up and in. Crowder goes back door, lays it up. Layup won't go. The follow missed. Godala couldn't get it to go down. And here comes Marcus Smart. Sidestep, kicks it out. Walker back to Haywood. Jalen Brown again, where Crowder has been good defensively here in the opening minutes. And, and Duncan Robinson, too. You know, they're always trying to pick on him as Kimber Walker. Percentage-wise, getting to the line and making free throws. Dragic to Crowder. Shot clock down to four. Crowder has to hoist it up. And Marcus Smart grab. Here's Tyler Hero, tries the Euro step, gets inside. His layup, missed it. Jalen Brown from straight on. That's a three. Toronto had a 21.8 rebound for steal game. We'll start.
Robinson finds Iguodala. Duncan Robinson back to Iguodala. Shot clock at four. Good look for Duncan Robinson. Shot won't go, but another foul. Jalen Brown drives, gets in the paint. Can't finish that time. Tyler Hero able to track it down. Hero has not just been scoring, but his rebounding and distributing. He's done a little bit of everything. Dragic, nice move, and gets the bounce. To contain that if they're going to switch one through five. I think Grant Williams may be coming in for him. Nice entry pass into Tice, but he's double teamed. Celtics have to swing. And Hero bump Hayward with four of the Tice. We never had to touch it. You can take the thing out of there, Mike. Iguodala with a corner three. That misses, comes right back. Dragic fake inside. And a hell ball down. So the rookie Williams getting some minutes here in game five. Gordon Hayward three misses. And Boston playing without either Smart or Walker. So totally point guardless. Duncan Robinson connect 13 more in game three. And then had an off night in game four. Tatum gets inside, layup bounces around. Miami lead, final minute, first quarter. Adebayo calling for it. Robinson, nice feed out of bio. And he's fouled by Tice to four. Jalen Brown, nice move, count it, and one. Substitutions depend on what the other team is doing. Duncan Robinson, not that time. Rebound Haywood. Tatum kicks it out. Brown fakes. Shot clock winding down. And